Hello friend, when we designing a component for a various application, at that time our component is goes under different conditions of sometimes it is on impact loading, some and other external forces are there. So the parameter that need to be considered is energy absorption before the failure. The energy absorption before failure is nothing but the ability of component to absorb the energy before it reaches to failure point okay so before the failure point the energy absorbed by the component is called as energy absorption before failure okay when a component is subjected to impact or any other external forces then the energy from the impact is absorbed by the component okay the energy absorption capacity of component is depends on the its design its material property and many other factors so why the energy absorption before failure is important so the energy absorption before failure is a very important parameter uh, to consider in a component design for a several reason uh, like first one is a uh, it help to ensure that the component can withstand the external forces without breaking or failing okay and this is particularly uh, important for uh, safety critical applications such as uh, automotive or aerospace components where the fa uh, failure can result in a serious consequences okay so uh, uh, be, uh, it withstand the external process it so the energy absorption uh, before failure uh, it shows that how much forces it can withstand before the failure okay so it's uh, denoted by energy absorption before the failure okay and the second one is uh, it help to improve the overall performance of the component by reducing the stresses strain uh, uh, on the component and it is uh, on the surrounding so the energy absorption before failure uh, we can measure uh, through varieties of method uh, like uh, physical testing or uh, computer simulations okay so the physical testing uh, uh, involve the subjecting the uh, component to an impact or the external force so you can take the example of automotive crash test is there so in that method uh, we are uh, uh, means applying the uh, uh, impact load on the car and uh, 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 and measuring the energy absorption before the failure okay and uh, second one is the computer simulation so in that we uh, with the help of the different software uh, we predict the uh, behavior of the component under the different uh, uh, load condition or the uh, impact or the external forces uh, if you see in the automotive crash test the energy absorption capacity of car front uh, bumper is critical to protect the passenger in case of front end collision so the car front bumper uh, uh, is critical to protect the passenger in case of front collision so the bumper is designed to absorb the energy from the impact and the minimize the damage to the rest of the car and its occupant okay so so we will design and we will select the material for the bumper so that it can absorb the maximum energy before the failure and uh, it will minimize the damage to the rest of the car okay and second example you can take in the aerospace application like uh, in aerospace component such as landing gear wings are designed to absorb the energy from the impact and to the other external forces during the takeoff and the landing okay this helps to ensure the safety of the passenger and the crew so friend yeah that's it for this video if you like this video please like share and subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon thank you for watching see you in the next video